Hey guys, Android Rooted Pro here, and today I'm going to be sharing with you my top five rooted applications. This can also be a great start to understanding why you should root your device in the first place, and basically what your device is capable of doing when you have these rooted applications. And to get started off here, number one I'm going to start talking about is Directory Bind. You can see on the top left hand side of my screen. And basically, Directory Bind, if you haven't seen my last video, is an application that allows you to manually place uh, apps that you download from your browser to your external SD card. This way you can transfer large application data directories to external SD by binding your Android directories on both storages. This is a great application for those who have low internal storage memory. Um, you, you can also play large data games that range from about a gig of memory to, I don't know, to like a gig and a half directly from your external SD card just simply by binding your two directories as if you've seen my last video you can go ahead and check it out it just gives a full explanation on how to use this application and number two of course is one of my favorites so that's green greenify and basically this is just a great battery saver application and improves how smooth your phone runs throughout the day it allows you to pick and choose which applications that you want to hibernate they cannot start running on their own in the background like other apps you know um, let happen they can only start running when you want them to or just by simply um, just by simply turning them on for instance let's just see right here you push the the plus button and it gives you applications that may slow down your device so you can go ahead and click on one of the applications and click the green arrow and it'll just go ahead and hibernate it and as you can see these are all the app applications that are hibernated on my device right now so it just speeds up your device it improves your battery throughout the day by far and this is just a, a great application in general and number three we're gonna go ahead and talk about root browser root browser you might have seen it if you've watched any of my other videos on how to root your device this app in my opinion is by far the best folder browser application it allows you to take full control of your root by letting the user browse through all directory folders. You can do a variety of tasks where they're manually changing your operating system fonts and backgrounds as well as many other nifty features. As you can see, you have all your directories that you wouldn't see by using just a standard folder application that comes pre-installed with your phone. Your storages, your system, and just everything. You have full control of everything. Just a great application. And number four, of course, is super user. Of course, SuperUser, which is a core of your rooted device that gives you control of your device and allows you to grant rooted applications to run on your rooted device. It also comes with some nifty security features as well as detailed logs, as you can see right here. And we have some uh, security features. You can create pins, uh, automatic responses. You have your apps list. Notifications. And this, you know, this just just basically what your phone should have if, if you if you rooted your device. It, it also allows you to update your binary directly from the application as well as it shows which uh, version of super user that you have as you can see on top. It shows you all the updated versions and what the updates include. And of course number five which is ROM Toolbox whether it be ROM Toolbox Pro, ROM Toolbox Lite it's just an all around great application. It allows you to take full control of your rooted device. This application allows you to install custom ROMs. It has a full app manager to remove or back up any applications, especially those hard-coded ones that come pre-installed in the most devices that no one really wants or needs. As you can see, the ROM manager and then the app manager. All you need to do is just click on the application. You can uninstall, you can back it up, you can freeze it, you can clear the cache, clear the data. It has so many other options for you to take control of your applications. It also has root browser, which is number three on my list, uh, directly added into the application. If you just scroll down, you'll see root browser right here. So you don't have to download root browser um, externally, but, but you still can. And if you've seen my latest video, it also allows you to configure apps to SD. Just scroll down again, and you can change the default storage location. As you can see, you can just click on SD card, and applications downloaded from the market or anywhere else will just be directly um, downloaded to your SD card instead of your internal storage. One of my favorite tools in this application is the full CPU control. As you can see, if you go to performance and you click on CPU control, it has custom sliders that allows you to change the speed of your of your device, how fast you want it to run, if you want it to run smoothly, and it also has little slides to where if you want to to be a battery saver, you know, you would just click all the way down and go all the way high if you want your phone to run on full full power just to get the most out of your applications.
I have mine sort of in the middle. That way, it's still smooth and it's and it doesn't um, it do doesn't drain my battery all the way down throughout the day. And of course, if you just scroll down, it has custom governors. You have your on demand, your user space, your power saver, your performance. Just so many different options for you to choose from, as well as your schedulers. You have your deadlines and your noobs. And then if you scroll over, you have your CPU profiles. You can just go ahead and create and add profiles. That way you can just go back and you don't have to mess around with the sliders anymore. You can just click an add profile, but you do have to unlock the features by purchasing ROM Toolbox Pro. And this is just the beginning. There's so many more features in ROM Toolbox. You can change your, your interface. You can change your font. Go by going into font installer, downloading so many different variety of fonts. And then you also have your boot animations have custom boot animations, your theme managers, status bar icons, there's just so much that this application comes packed in. And I would definitely recommend this application to any rooted user. And then of course if you just scroll to the left, you have your you have all of the tools that I just stated all in one little nifty uh, scroll bar. And then much much more so that's basically my top five applications for your rooted device directory bind greenify root browser of course super user and rom toolbox Lite or pro and yeah that's pretty much why you should root your phone in the first place you can take full control of your device you can pretty much have custom anything um, whether it be like i said um, custom boots custom fonts you can take control of your phone's speed you can overclock your phone you can underclock it it's just it's just there's so much things that you can do with your rooted device and these applications in general so if you guys uh, like this video uh, go ahead and like and comment and subscribe i'll be coming out with new videos every single week or every other day so i hope you enjoyed and uh, just leave a comment if you guys have any questions at all and i'll try to get back to you as soon as possible all right guys thanks for watching